Well, hello there, iPhone 7 Plus, with your two cameras in the back and new color options. It's a pleasure to meet you. And if you guys out there want to pick up one of these phones, it's going to be available starting September 16th. The story here is pretty similar, say, for the cameras with your iPhone 7 Cousin. If color options have changed a little bit, we've got rose gold still available, silver, gold, space gray is gone. It's now called black, and it is just black. And there is a new shinier jet black option here as well. Keeping this guy humming along 40 times faster than the predecessor with 50% better graphics is the A10 Fusion processor. It's also got water resistance now, so if maybe your sister pushes you in the pool, which happens to me about once a year, your phone's not gonna be damaged. You're not gonna have to yell at her to buy you a new one. The big story here, though, is the cameras on the back, and there are two 12 megapixel sensors, one wide angle and one telephoto, with f1.8 apertures, six element lenses, quad LED true tones. So the big story with two cameras is the zoom. So first you get two times optical zoom with a single push of a button, which is nice. But you can also now do digital zoom all the way up to 10 times. Obviously it's gonna degrade the image a little bit just by nature. The image you're gonna get is still gonna be good enough for posting on Facebook or even printing out uh, potentially. But we're gonna test that once we get it back in the Techno Buffalo offices. At coming sometime in October, you go ahead and actually live blur your background and get that bokeh effect that really DSLRs have been able to do for quite a while, but that won't be shipping at launch. Rounding out the camera department, you've got a seven megapixel front facing FaceTime HD camera. Battery life is also improved. Uh, no mention at all of wireless charging, so maybe next year. But you'll get an hour of better battery life versus what you had with the iPhone 6S Plus. And Apple doubled the storage. Audio 16 gigabytes, 32, 128, and 256 are going to be the option starting at 749. And if you covet that jet black, like I think I do, that's going to be 128 or 256 only. And also the home button. I mean, it's there, but it's now force touch and actually works pretty well. So it's not going to actually move the taptic engine that we've seen in the MacBook, the MacBook Pros now found its way into both versions of the iPhone and speakers, they louder. In fact, I can quantify it for you. They are two times louder because they're stereo now, one at the top and one at the bottom. And once again, it's all going to be available starting on September 16th. Resolution on the 5.5 inch screen is still 1080, but Apple spent a while talking about the color gamut, how it's been improved and how it matches cinema specs. So which phone is right for you? Is it the iPhone 7 Plus? Is it the iPhone 7? Let us know in the comments. Also, let us know what your favorite feature is. Were you excited? Were you overwhelmed, underwhelmed? Let us know. Till next time, I'm John Rettinger from Techno Buffalo.